All right, this is gold and daily chart. And as we said yesterday, we are looking for short after breaking this lower point because there is a strong uh, supporting line at the level of 49. Uh, 300 let's take it so there was a strong supporting line and we was looking for short after breaking the previous lower point so finally can see price not able to break this lower point and here you can see today not today yesterday we have seen some bullish candlestick pattern uh, let's check it this is called I think everybody knows this is called bullish engulfing pattern they are forming have you seen uh, this bullish candle engulfed by this bearish candle have you seen so uh, first we must know what type of candlestick pattern and what is the behavior so first we have seen this is the bullish engulfing pattern means uh, it is a probability to continue toward upside all right remember it is probability to continue toward upside but candlestick pattern should be appear in a right place now question is that is it a right place answer is yes because there are uh, you can see uh, 100 exponential moving average and here you can see rejection point means this area act as a support so here act as a resistance now they act as a support so once they appear we are expecting that price will continue toward uh, continue toward upside from this level because here you can see price was running toward downside downside and the finally somewhere here you can see there was a support and they are point they are trying to reverse back again from this area right that was down and it is a reversal point we are expecting okay so in that case we must find out some specific strategy and uh, entry point to enter in this market now let's just jump to small time frame like s4 okay just a minute now we must find out some resistance line so first here you can see this is the resistance line both moving average are there and another resistance line somewhere here it is a rejection point all right so now let's jump to h4 chart now you can see if if you wanna enter in this market in a buy direction so we must close our position somewhere here around five zero uh, i can say nine zero zero fifty thousand nine hundred that is the resistance line once they break this level so we'll continue toward upside or by direction so next level will be 20 uh, 52 uh, zero, zero. that is our next resistance line all right okay so must we must find out some uh entry point now let's jump to small time frame okay now this is 15 minutes now you can see 15 minutes uh, they are surfing moving average 7 have you seen it so in that case we are applying surfing trading strategy have you seen they are hugging this moving average 7 have you seen this dot dot line it is a 7 exponential moving average now you can see uh, most of the time we are using bouncing trading strategy like that price are bouncing some specific uh, moving average but uh, they are not bouncing any moving average somewhere here you can see they are bouncing here and they're bouncing here but the rest of that this area they are surfing have you seen let me show you let me zoom a little more have you seen there they are surfing this uh, moving average seven dot dot line have you seen okay so means are we gonna apply two strategy one called surfing training strategy so i think everybody knows and another is uh, bouncing trading strategy for the bouncing uh, you can see uh, price are bouncing from moving average 20 that is a exponential moving average EMA EMA exponential moving average and another here you can see this is the 7 EMA 7 EMA okay this is 7 EMA uh, it is a surfing and uh, 20 is bouncing means if price retrace back toward moving average uh, 7 and after that we will place buy order so everybody knows i think who people bought my uh, technical analysis course how we are applying so and another if price retrace toward moving average 20 
so that will be our bouncing trading strategy so do opportunity so i hope you enjoy this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching